activities of our limbs. Now, Lord, we have studied, but we are waiting on your anointing. We ask that you will word my lips. Give me what you would have to say to your people on today. And God, when you are done, so am I. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. We thank God for being here on this morning. Amen. Give an honor to the pastor. Amen. Who is sailing? Amen. Sailing. Amen. 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 To the first lady who is not sick. Well. Amen. <laughs> She's here with us on today. I'm so glad to have you. Amen. To all the mothers, the deacons, the missionaries, everybody, mom and them, everybody. everybody. Amen. We're just glad to have y'all with us on this morning. I'm so glad to have my co workers. Amen. To be here. I have. <laughs>
I was gonna say clothes, but we're not even gonna go there. Whatever. Amen. And I, I wanted to skip over clothes because I did something yesterday. I went and bought this because I would I have to tell it again. Because I wanted it to be cool. Because they said it was going to be hot. When I got home, after the stores had closed, uh -huh. I began to think, you already have that dress. <laughs> <laughs> so I said, no you don't. No you don't. I didn't even go into that closet. No you don't. You do have it in gray. You have it in burgundy. You have it in ivory. But you don't have this color. See? And I placated myself with that. But then I got up this morning. And that thing was nagging me. That you already have. Don't put that dress on. You already have that dress. And I said, well, you know, since Jesse, I kicked him out. <laughs> I took his room and used it as a closet. closet. Mm -hmm. So I went into my secret closet mm -hmm. and looked in, pulled out. Guess what? So. Amen. That really aggravated me that I'm now spending money that I really don't have to spend buying stuff all over again. Amen? Amen. So I have torn up rooms looking for receipts and papers and clothes. And I call myself putting them in a safe place. So safe that I can't remember. find them. And then I can't remember what the safe place is. Uh -huh. And the bad part is I'll say to myself, Look in such and such a place, and you'll find it. And then I said, there is no way that you could have put it there. No way that you could have put it there. So I have torn up rooms, purses, everything, cleared shelves trying to find stuff. The other day I was trying to find a pair of earrings that I knew that I had. So I go in and start looking. Found other stuff I was looking for. Stopped, looked at that. Two years, two hours later, I still ain't found the earring. <laughs> and that little thing in my mind said, "Go to where I said, look." And I said, "It cannot be there." Mm. Only to go after having this argument, went and found the earrings in the last place that I looked. Amen. Amen. Now here I am, sweaty mad, and everything else, and I got to put back all this stuff I done pulled out. <laughs> that aggravates me. Amen? Amen? That just aggravates me. The other type of looking that I hate, and women can really get with this, is when I'm looking for a certain item. It might be a dress. You need something and you have something in mind. It can't be just the run of the mill everyday dress. It has to be a certain dress. It has to be a certain style. It has to be a certain color. And so the search begins. You've gone to Marshalls. You've gone to Nordstrom's. You've gone to the Rack. You go to Del Mambo. You go to Costa Mesa. You're searching high and low. You find the color but then it's not the right size. You find the color and the size, but then it costs too much. That part. Or then you find the color, the size, and the price, but it just ain't speaking to you. Women, you know what I'm talking about. You know that, that dress that calls your name, Diane. You try to leave the store and say, Diane. You say, I'm not even listening to you, Diane. <laughs> and so you end up, did you say indecisive? No. <laughs> we just know what we're looking for. Amen. Amen. I went into a store to buy something, and the lady said, Well, here's the color. I said, Can't
and I at least like him if I'm going to pay him. <laughs> Amen. It needs to say something to me. So here I am, trying on, rejecting, rejecting, rejecting. It ain't this, it's too short, sleeves don't fit, it's ugly. Try it on, it look cute on the hanger, put it on, it's a hot mess. Amen. <laughs> but then I end up just getting soft. Because I don't want to go home empty handed. I've been at the store since 10 o'clock, it is now 5 o'clock. I done burned up a gas, a tank of gas. Amen. 